as we get set for the finale of this five game homestand for the Edmonton Oilers. Ishir wins the draw. The Devils coming off consecutive 6 3 setbacks in Vancouver and at Calgary on Wednesday. Yes, a pool yard beyond now with his line mates, Dreisaitl and Zach Hyman, who played his 400th game in Edmonton's 6 1 shellacking of Buffalo on Thursday and contributed two apples. Pooley-Arby from Drysaddle. Riz shot the save made by Gillies, and that dribbled through him, but what? Here's a shot score! Drysaddle picked up the rebound and rammed it home, and Edmonton has taken a 1-0 lead. Back into the lineup after missing 12 games in that game a couple nights ago versus Buffalo. That's the shot by Pooley-Arby right there. Gillies has no idea where that puck is. He doesn't understand that it's gone through him. It's gone to the far side. Watch the skate, the puck. Two stick of Leon Dreisaitl, just a nice little kick up to his stick, jams at home on the short side. Gilly still doesn't know where it is, too late to get back into position. Ryan McLeod playing against older brother Michael. Into the zone, taking off the puck, Jonas Siegenthal, Dougie Hamilton, and now he sure sets up a breakaway for Brad. What a move, tucks it home, past the right skate of Miko Koskinen, and we are deadlocked at one. And for Jesper Bratt, that's his 20th of the year and first in nine games. In the last four years in the National Hockey League, he's just exploded this year. And just that quick little pop by Duncan Keith, and that's the second time. The New Jersey Devils have been out in an out outnumbered rush that is a two-on-one. Koskinen bails them out in that situation, but a beauty move by Bratt. He walks in, head up the whole way, deeks to the back, and forehand tucks it around the pad of Koskinen. Let's see whether we have a tilt here. I think they're gonna go. And they are gonna go. Yep. Cassian gets inside on Geertsen early. Lands a couple of left hands. Unloads an overhand left that misses. Geertsen can go both. Left hand, Cassian, three lefts, Geertsen. Strong left, Cassian. Clipped him with an uppercut, left hook. Short with a left hook, but he's got the left hand free. Geertsen misses with an overhand left. Cassie in a glancing blow. Gerson misses with a big right hand and a lot of heavy lumber exchange between Gerson and Cassie. And it's been a while since we've seen that kind of punching power. McDavid couldn't find it. That puck continued to pinball around. Hughes off the board, sent back the other way. McDavid. Kane dragged it around. Hughes takes it to the hole. Wrap around and a save made. Gillies just got the left skate over. It's a little slow getting across, but just in time. Well, watch this, and this is just an excellent move. Get your feet moving, challenge the defender. He recognizes it's he's sure a forward. He says, I'm going to wrap this around. Now, Gillies did get across, but you were astute in that. He did get across, but a little slow. Look how far the pad's in the net, and that's why it's a goal. It's over the line. Excellent move by Evander Kane. After video review, the play at 212, the puck fully crossed the goal line, therefore we have a goal. Severson off a Cassian dump in, quickly advanced through to Jesper Bratt. Nico Heeshear, drop pass, shot, rifled wide by Ryan Graves, and the rebound redirected home. Bratt needed a bounce, and he and the Devils got one. It's 2 all. Well, we just talked about it. They're not going to go away. They're a team that likes to push the issue, and this line's been real good for the Devils. And just a good passing play. Everybody touched that puck on the sequence. Gets a little bit lucky with the bounce and carry him off the wall. Right to Brad. It's Grays that takes the shot, goes high, and bounces right back down to Brad. Give him credit. Hand-eye coordination, quick reflexes, bounces it off. For Edmonton, now this game is tied once again. They've gone up twice in this game. The New Jersey Devils have battled back to tie it both times in the balance in the third period. Here's a steal by Brad, already with two, heading for a backhander to save Custer. Rebound, backhander is in! Nico Heeshear, and New Jersey has just taken its first lead of the afternoon at 3-2 for Heeshear. His 17th. It's just sloppy play again, coming out of the zone. It's a good stick by him. He takes it away from Dreisaitl, fights off the check of Darnell Nurse and Cody Cece. They both go towards him, though. They're both all over him. Because of that, he draws them back in behind the net, and he sure walks in. Chris Russell, spun it behind. 
Ryan and Fogle, a couple of ex-Canes, Barry and Shore. Russell drag move to the middle. On his backhand, he'll find Barry. Sharp angle scores! What a shot! Tyson Barry ties the game! Take this puck and just slip down. He notices a little space right there. He knows it's short, it's up high as a forward. Gives himself an option, puts his stick there, takes his pass head up the whole way. And look at this. This is a sharp angle shot, but no question. He recognizes the six foot six Gillies is down. He's tight to that post, aim for the head. That's exactly what he does, and he buries. Can't chop it out of the zone. Siegenthaler, hard rim. What a play by a dry with that big paddle to knock it down for McDavid. Stutter step. Dish to Tyson Berry. McDavid works his way inside, trying to get in front of it. It's a goal! Evander Kane on the ricochet and buries it. And Edmonton has regained the lead, 4 to 3. And you make your breaks, you really do. This is a pass that was put across the attempt to get it to dry saddle, but it goes off the New Jersey Devils player. I believe it's the cloud as he dies. Prevents this cross seam pass, but it goes right to Evander Kane and a quick back hit. Smack, if you want to call it, puts it home. Fifth consecutive two point game for Connor McDavid, the league leader in scoring at 89 points for the year now. Just 11 shy of that century mark. Dry saddle to Nurse. And now CeCe a shot redirected off Gillies. And Pugliarvi in front. Spilled in. And Watch him funnel the net. We talked about this. Get bodies in front of a tall goaltender. Gillies has to react aggressively. Doesn't quite corral that puck in a beautiful little play. By Pogliarvi to get it to Dreisaitl, he knows exactly where Hyman is. One touch pass, Hyman just shovels it home. He's here. Clubs it back to Hamilton. What a steal by McDavid. He's got an empty net, and he'll make no mistake. For the captain, punctuated by his 35th. Yeah, goals and five straight now for Connor McDavid. No chance to get this one to Evander Kane. He wants to finish this off, and that's the right call. They'll bring you the finish.